name is Simon, I'm the tutor on the T-Level Construction. It's actually called T-Level Construction Design, Surveying and Planning. And I, I lead the design side and I, I, together with my colleague George and we, we teach the whole T-Level. Okay, the T-Level is a, it's a brand new course and it's written by industry. It's a full-time course and it's worth three A-Levels. So it's level three, it's exactly the same as th um, three A-Levels. We teach design, surveying and planning, which covers basically probably what you think of as architecture and surveying the site and working out what can be built, what's going to um, create loads of money for the developer, what does the client want, looking at lots of things as well as, as law and how you can basically produce a really excellent sustainable building. Um, the way that we teach the course is that we run through the sequence of basically taking a, a blank piece of land or an empty plot and working out what can go on there and then we have um, the students go out and do surveys and what we call feasibility so we go, we go off and look at things like trees or flooding, what, what could be have impact on the site. And then each week, so for example you've been looking at designing buildings one week, then we'll set some assessments so tests so you've understood that. So each week we go through a different part of the, of the knowledge, then um, we test you regularly so, and that's building towards some exams at the end. So at the end of year one you get all your knowledge tested in two exams plus. We also teach you the skills, so one day a week you'll be doing um, some CAD, some really advanced computer ready design and drawing and model making. So we also test that at the end of the year in a, in a project. So when you come to do the T-level with us, You'll be in three days a week, nine till four, they're quite long days, quite intense days working with your tutors and your colleagues on the course. Um, you would spend at least a day a week on top of that doing um, independent study. So we, we use Google Classroom and we set you lots of things to do on that to keep your brain active and for you to work through those skills and knowledge at home. And we'd also expect you um, in the second year to spend a, um, a one day a week at least on um, with an employer on an industri industry placement. So an industrial placement is where you spend time with a, an actual employer doing real work. So that, in, by the second year, you'll be up to five days a week. So class sizes, at the moment, are capped at 15, so it's a nice small number, so you'll get to know your colleagues really well. And yeah, it means we've got um, a quite good one-to-one -one time with, with tutors as well. So we, the thing we really aim to do on this course is to get to know you individually, find out what your skills are, and line you up with the right sort of career and employment. So we're really keen to make sure that all 15 people go on to something really, really useful that suits them afterwards. Our assessment is by exam, external exam set by Pearson. So it's a, everybody up and down the country is set, sitting the same exam at the same time. There'll be one exam that covers the sort of science and the technology and some of the calculations you need to do when you're designing buildings and the other one will be about the industry so how to make money how to follow the law how to make sure that you what you have designed is going to work really well and then we do 15 hour projects where you in the first year where you get to design a building and get to plan and do a presentation about what you've designed in the second year you actually only do um, an assessment, so there's no exams in the second year, but you are tested on your skills in surveying and using CAD and designing and presenting what you've done. Because this course is cutting edge, we are using some of the latest equipment. We have got VR enabled uh, CAD um, development software, so you, the aim is to be able to show your client not just what the building looks like in, in plan or you know, in the sort of technical side, but also they should be able to see what it looks like uh, there's things like the sun moving around the building, so we have VR systems, we have um, live rendering, we have uh, laser cutters, we've got access to 3D printers, all sorts of um, equipment to make the design a bit really good. We've also got surveying equipment to um, send you out on the field, to using surveying staffs and levels. Um, and we also need to cover things like drone surveying and um, other site specific stuff which is all very high tech. Right, so this qualification is worth three A-levels, so you get exactly the same UCAS points. So universities are, um, are accepting that T-levels is equivalent to three A-levels. So um, one route out of this course will be to, to universities that specialise in um, things like architectural technology and construction management, 
um, design management and um, also probably what I would push more than just traditional universities is um, degree apprenticeship. So a lot of, of our students go on to work for an employer, like it might be a, a big developer, so like Wilmot Dixon or um, Morgan Sindel, and they would take them on and pay, pay for them to go to university as they as they are employed. So that's actually where we try and push our students to go afterwards. Um, lots of success stories on our construction and built, built environment courses. We've got students at UWE, at Brighton, Reading, Kingston, Leicester, they've all gone off to do things like architecture, um, architectural technology, building surveying, construction management, um, look quantity surveying is also really popular, it's a really exciting career and guaranteed to make you loads of money. So we we have lots of students that have gone on and some really well paid and interesting jobs. So if you want to apply, please head over to the website and look for T-level design, surveying and planning for construction and I um, hope to see you soon.